So, as you may already know, with the arrival of Season 5, we have given away 7,000 credits over the past week to random people so they can get a brand new Rocket Pass. And we've got a massive giveaway coming up, so make sure to subscribe. So, we previously took a look at the brand new Titanium White Rocket Pass Gold Explosion, and it looks good to be fair, but never did I ever think the price would hit this high. Right, guys so welcome back to the channel i hope you're having a fantastic and safe day as always so in the brand new rocket pass if you hit tier 174 i do believe you get a brand new titanium white gold explosion and yeah it looks really good to be fair we tried it on before but i just can't believe what it's done to the market and the price on the spreadsheet is definitely gonna blow you away but yeah make sure to subscribe daily rocket league content daily giveaways and daily side swipe content is gonna be on this channel 1k thumbs up if you are hyped up to get this gold explosion and yeah let's jump straight into it quickly before we do jump into this video i'd love to give a huge shout out to the fan favorite sponsor on the channel aoa.com so i've been working with these guys for several years now and they're the fastest and most reliable place to pick up any rocket league item and by using the code in the description you are going to get yourself six percent off every single purchase so, for the fact that it's the first time in like three or four days we haven't made a side swipe video, we're going to be bringing it back to the classic where we're going to be taking a look at the Rocket League market over the past 48 hours with the most popular items. So, there's no bias street, and yeah, let's get straight to it. So, very first item, there's no surprise whatsoever. It's going to be the White Octane, which right now actually is around 13,000 credits on the spreadsheet. It's been about this price for a long time, but actually went down a little bit when it, obviously the brand new season came out, but it's gone back up a little bit now. So, it's chilling. We'll probably be about 12 to 13k for like the next month or so. Then, going to be White Emerald, which I don't really know because I haven't really been trading the past few days. Obviously, been absolutely sweating Rocket League side swipe. So, fair enough. It's gone from like, I think 2,000 credits-ish to 2.8, which massive, massive jump. And honestly, it could be a good investment in the long run. We will have to wait and see what they do with rotations, etc. Then, regular Fennec. Yeah, good for profit if you find someone that wants to buy a Fennec, like regular. But yeah, other than that, not going to be that great. White Dune Racer. Okay, this really shocks me. Had loads of people talking to me about this, but no idea what it's doing. It's at 5.5k-ish right now, and actually was so, so cheap. Like nearly 3,000 credits at one point. So it just goes to show some items can go up over time, I guess. We will have to wait and see what that does in the future. Then we have got the White Zombies, which it's been about 2k for the longest time ever. It's been jumping around from like 1.9 to 2.1, but we move, fellas. We move. White Fennec, been 2.5. For like the past half a year, not even joking. If you could pay like maybe 2k ish, will be good for profit. But other than that, it's not going to be that beneficial, to be honest with you. We are slowly but surely creeping up on an item which I'm sure every single one of you wants to hear about. But next up, Instellar. A basic decal, but honestly, if you want a good looking decal for under a thousand credits, this is definitely going to be your go to. It looks so, so good. Then we've got mainframe. Been 1.1k for the longest time ever. Same with Dissolver, same with Julian Dragons, etc. But then we move on to the Titanium White Cosmosis. 8,000 to 10,000 credits. We have never seen a Rocket Pass this high in my life. Like, nothing's even come close. I don't think an item's ever hit even at 5k. And goes to show that it's not even just popping off on Xbox. You've got a PS4 and PS5 where it is nearly 7,000 credits. Then you've got PC where they haven't actually got a price yet. Just because... We've got no clue, boys. Like, we've got no clue what you can actually sell it for. Probably way over 10k. Then, Switch is going to be 8k. But it just, it blows my mind. Because think of it. The only people that have got it will more than likely have to buy the tiers up to that. Which is going to cost them over 20,000 credits. Plus all the other colours. Which... Oh my god, it is just an absolute madness. Completely depending on how you look at this gold explosion, it could be a blessing in disguise, or if you don't like it, more than likely all of the other gold explosions are going to be a little bit less in demand, just because this is the best one in the game by far. I will say it, it looks better than Hellfire, like obviously there's more nostalgia there for me, but better than Hellfire, and it also destroys the market as well for all of the other Rocket Pass items that are like brand new, because everyone just cares about a gold explosion. No one even cares about the wheels, decals, Anything like that. Some of the trails are cool, but this has definitely taken over. But yeah, moving on swiftly from that, we have got Dissolver, which has been 1.1k for the past few months, realistically. It's gone from like 900 to 1.3 every now and then, but it's not really going to do anything unless credit demand does an absolute madness. Then we got Crimson Octane. I sold it like a month or two ago for 1.5. Was a little bit hesitant, but it's done nothing on a spreadsheet since, except from go up and down a tiny bit. So we digress, fellas. Then, gonna be big splash. Unless it gets taken out of rotation, maybe it'll creep up to like 500 credits. A thousand would be an absolute dream come true. But it, there's just so many all over the market. I just can't see it happening anytime soon. Then we got Drilling Dragons. It's 1k minimum price on a spreadsheet, which is, it should be shocking, but it's been around this price for the longest time ever. So yeah, I don't think it's really going to move that much, honestly. Then we got Skyblock Octane. 
once again, it's been about 1.2 to so 1.4-ish for the longest time ever. And yeah, obviously, it isn't really doing anything on the spreadsheet right now. Then we've got the line one. It's been, <laughs> I feel like it's like a non-stop record, but yeah, same scenario for the line octane. Done practically nothing on the spreadsheet in the past few months. Then we got black standard. Ah, uh, once again, I just I could just play an old video right now, and you'll be you wouldn't notice because it's done the same thing around 2,000 credits for the longest time ever. Doom Racer. Yeah, once again, similar scenario. Was 80 to 100 credits at one point, which is criminal. That and now it's 100 to 150. Still incredibly low. Next up, we've got the almighty 20XX, which is normally right at the bottom, to be fair. But it's gone up a little bit uh, on the demand anyway. But it hasn't really moved on the spreadsheet since. And it's going to be 500 credits-ish. Not even that now. Wow, so, so cheap. Then it's going to be the white mainframe, which once again, I could just take a screenshot from like six months ago. Use that and I'll be fine. Because 9.8 to 10.6 is all the price I see. It goes up and down every now and then. But every time I record, it's that same price. I swear, like every single time. It's ridiculous. Then, gonna be simple gay. I could literally, like, I don't know. I, don't, I just don't understand. This thing hasn't moved on the spreadsheet in such a long time. You can tell it's in demand a little bit. Because it's still getting searched. But it's been that same price for, I want to say a year. Honestly, I want to say a year. It's, just, it's literally done nothing on the spreadsheet. Then going to be titanium white standard. It's been about a K for the longest time ever. Goes up and down every now and then. But quite a boring item. It's white, but looks great in game. So not amazing. Then it's going to be fire god. Which, yeah, it goes up and down a little bit from like 600 to 700. And yeah, it looks okay. But a little bit of a B-Tech. Uh, what is it? Heatwave in my opinion. Anyway, we move on. Going to be the grey octane, which... Yep, it's been about 600, 700 for the longest time ever. Good for profit as always with Octanes if you're paying like 450 and getting even the mid or min if you want to get a quick sell. You know, they're always good to make quick and easy profit. Then you've got to have White and Stellar. Been around 2k for the longest time. Goes from like 2 to 2.5. So if you want to buy one, now's probably not a horrific time to be fair. And then we've got the Cobalt Octane to finish off doing absolutely nothing on the spreadsheet lovely stuff yeah that's gonna be it for today i hope you guys did enjoy and more than likely as well with this gold explosion no one else is gonna be getting it in the game everyone that would have bought the tiers would have already bought them for the rocket pass to get this gold explosion and it's gone up on the spreadsheet on every other platform and with it being ten thousand credits on xbox right now wouldn't surprise me if it snuck up to 12 in like the next few days. I'm not even joking. But yeah, if you want to subscribe, you obviously can do for daily Rocket League content and daily giveaways. 1k thumbs up if you want to see more trading stuff. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow.